grapes? Dead. Yeah, you don't want to eat those grapes, Dead. do you? Dead. I don't know, they're a little old. Dead. Let's leave them there, please. Come on. That has mold. Would you like popsicle? You want popsicle? Cool. Popsicle. Yep. Cool. Yeah, very good. Open, open, open. I opened it. It's open. Open, It's open. Open. It's open. Open. Yep. Open. It's open. 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 It's open. Open. You're welcome. Open. You're welcome. Good Goodbye. Do you need help? Yeah. Push it down. Oh, there you go. He has just started talking, and it is the absolute. My little guy is yelling, screaming. Oh, he's having such a good time. Come on, little girl. Come on. It is so funny how this cat, who's supposed to be a feral farm cat, has taken to this indoor lifestyle. I think yesterday she went outside for five minutes. But then she begged to come back inside. Now I expected that when we were 19 degrees and the wind chill was colder. Did not expect that on like a 50 degree day when it was barely sprinkling. Okay. So, there's that. Let's see what's going on over here. Boy. Oh boy, um, this looks like, um, scrapbooking material. So, I will go through that at a later date. Sentimental things. This is probably not a good first thing to go through, but if not now, when? <laughs> um, okay. Yeah, one thing I have noticed that I do. See that beer bottle collection back there? It was in a large box, like larger than my box. <laughs> And I did get rid of a lot of it. <clears throat> but the minute I grabbed things that brought back these flood of memories from when I was a young adult, I have noticed that I am having huge trouble getting that stuff out immediately. So what I did was, oh yeah, I remember I was a young adult. I would have friends over, my mom and dad would bring me cool beers from their excursions, or they'd give me, my dad would give me cool beers for Christmas or my birthday, and I saved the containers. If I had friends over, I saved the containers. Uh, there's a beer keg over there, that was from our Halloween party. And um, so all that stuff was like, oh, yeah! as soon as I uncovered it because I used it to decorate my apartment and then because I mean you're a young adult you don't have money for decor so 
I used that kind of stuff because I was spending it on beer. <laughs> so I put that stuff up as my decor because that was one of my hobbies. I liked trying beer. And um, then, um, and I liked having friends over and having beers with my friends. And so um, I, when I got married, I moved that. My dad and I made this really great thick wooden shelf and it lived in our um, kitchen much to probably a lot of my in-laws dismay <laughs> and so we had this really cool uh, beer bottle collection there and we added to it with mead jar from our wedding and my sister-in-law's wedding they gave out wine as favors so we have a wine bottle from that and so I had I picked the best of the best I told myself I'm not gonna save the whole thing and I have the cabinets like I had in my apartment so let's do it pick out the best of the best and put it on this one cabinet this is your boundary and put it on this one cabinet in my kitchen and then i said okay so i will have to get up there and clean the top of the cabinet and put the paper down and i'll have my husband help me put the bottles up there and then it'll look great it'll look just like when i was younger and then the more i started thinking about it like <clears throat> you have a supportive needs child who's the toddler still who you want to play with more than you want to clean house you have a young adult who still needs to be chauffeured to places occasionally and on your list of things that you want to do nowhere does it say take the beer bottles down once a year and clean it and so the more I thought about it it was like why did I, I the I took like three of them in and set them on my kitchen windowsill to remind myself I needed to do that project that was three months ago I'm not gonna do this it's not gonna happen we don't have time and I don't want to make time for it so I'm gonna take pictures of the beer bottles this is what I've realized take pictures of the things that cause me serious serious sentimental value put them on my Instagram or have them in the, my video here and then when I want to see them I can just scroll <laughs> so that is what needs to get done now um, things like this are already in picture form so that is awesome these are uh, forget the size of the mirror I think it was 6.5 meter but I used to work in a mirror lab where they made telescope mirrors yeah 6.5 the mirror yeah the mirror is a 6.5 mirror and a 6.5 millimeter diameter <laughs> wait <laughs> the mirror this white thing here with the suction grabbies is a 6.5 meter diameter mirror and a handling ring um, and a handling ring that was built by some of my old friends um, that is 8.4 meters in diameter and this all occurs underneath the football stadium at this really cool place that I used to work. And they made mirrors for um, Hubble. And I think uh, one of the fun ones um, that just opened up, I forget the name of it, but is it LSS? Uh, it's the one that takes a picture a day so they can map the entire universe. So these get saved. <laughs> this was, this was my kind of my first job I think yeah that was my first job so that goes in a in a Jennifer bin now these are gonna be hard yeah I don't think I'm gonna go through this <laughs> now that I see this I'm not going through this this is my yeah I'm not going through this um, there are some things I can get rid of out of here um. Oh well, yeah. Okay, I can I can do Dan K. White's get rid of the transfer and the whatever. I can do that. This looks like it's been damaged, which is unfortunate because my parents got me this, and this is really cool. But it looks like it's been damaged with the over the years. But it's a saw blade with a tiger painted on it. That's pretty cool. Okay. Rule number one, already violated. I did not get a box for donation. <laughs> Hark! The Herald Angels sing. 
These are my petrified rocks from where I grew up. Uh, okay, so I used to have all these really cute things set up in one of those Coke bottle. Um, back when I was a kid, it was cool to put Coke bottle racks, the wooden ones, on your on your walls, and put little things in them. It's cute, but I don't need it anymore. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, please don't tell me I just broke this. Oh my. I think that was lucky. I think I fractured it, but I don't think I broke it. Okay. This is a piece of pottery from where I grew up. This is, don't pack multiple things. This is my, so that, those are actually, I'm going to keep those in a sentimental. These little guys were the cutest thing when I was growing up. <laughs> but I don't really, I don't really, I mean, I, I would, I, my new, my new muscles say you don't need this because you aren't going to display it for Easter because my old muscles is like oh, put it in the Easter bin this has sentimental value you used to love it when you were a kid you know what I love my kids <laughs> I don't need these See, like these guys, I'm not sure. There's my little glass key from when I was a kiddo that I would probably keep. Um, and another piece of pottery from where I was from. I love these things. They're such little things. I don't, I might, oh, I think I did damage this. Ugh. Well, we'll see how long it lasts. Okay. Some point, my grandmother probably got me this, but I don't need it for the memories. That's not really my grandma. I mean, my grandmother did cats and things, but another little piece of pottery that I love. I have to come up with some kind of a... <laughs> oh boy, there were moths or something in this one. Oh boy, yucky. Chocolate anyone? <laughs> I think it was probably from my friend in Germany or Brazil. Eek. That's pretty bad. Oh yeah, there's worms in it. Yucko. Yucko! Okay. More pottery. I don't see this. First thing I see is, <gasps> yep, Easter. I don't think I really need this for Easter though. <clears throat> Hi, Ruby. Oh my goodness. Now I kind of don't want to touch the stuff. Oh. The worms also ate my squirrel. That's pretty bad, but worms ate my squirrel. <laughs> Poor squirrel. What did that squirrel ever do to you? Okay. Um. This my grandmother got me. My great my grandmother. 
89. Guess where she wanted me to go to school? Guess what school was the last school my family could afford to send me to? <laughs> so I think um, this will probably, I'll just get a picture and then I'll. It's a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Okay. Um, again, cute, but I don't need it anymore. It's sweet, but I don't have room for tchotchkes. I don't want dusting. <clears throat> oh, the worms got my kitty cat and my mousie. Grr! <laughs> Kitty cat in my mousey. I didn't even remember I had that. That's funny. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, I've played with these so much. Probably got one. In, probably got this on one of our trips from that my parents and I took from um, the Southwest to Canada. We went to Wyoming or something, probably. Go find the family homestead. <clears throat> These guys. And I've tried finding some for my daughter, and I am I did not have any luck. These um Hagen Reniker. Those guys. These little cats, like this one has a busted tail because I used to play with them all the time. <laughs> I love cats. My grandma was a cat breeder. This one I think I can part with. piece of fossilized wood so that's gonna get kept um, a good luck souvenir from old Tucson old Tucson just burned down my mother used to work there I think I'm saving this um, this breaks my heart cuz I kind of want to save it but I don't really want to I remember this as a kid being in my room all the time Maybe that's another thing I take a picture of and then get rid of. Donate. Just like this little one. This is so sweet. This one's tiny enough. Maybe I could put it, I could sneak it in a, put it in my bathroom cabinet or something just because it's so cute. I like keeping little, little things. I think this is probably, my mom used to sell Avon. If you know, you know. <laughs> so it's probably from something like that. I'll put this guy up here. So I take him in and find a little spot for him. Okay, I think this was, and I probably really don't need it. This was my prom. Maybe, I don't know. I think. I didn't marry my prom date, so I would keep it normally just because it was my prom. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this one is a favorite of mine that will get saved. Little cats drinking the spilled milk. This one isn't so much a favorite, so I'm not sure if I will save it. I don't, I'm not really keen on white cats. So I think I will let go of that one. <coughs> this guy. Hmm. It's not uh, picking it up, is it? There he goes. That guy's getting saved. So I have three little cats to place places, and that's fine. Okay. 
And this, I'm not sure what this was, but I, I kind of think it's something from my grandma. My son would have a good time with it. It's a mouse. It's lost its rubber tail over the years, but you pull it back and it zooms. I think my my son would like to play with that. <laughs> He's the right age right now. Okay. Yeah. A metallic rock. Metallic looking rock. I don't even know if that's real. Is it real? I don't know. Looks like the Chicago bean. <laughs> and then a picture of my goddaughter. She does not look like this anymore. <laughs> so I think uh, I would rather have a newer picture of her. So um, I think that goes, that gets taken out and the frame gets donated. Okay. Oh, and here's a bullet from old Tucson from the gunfighters. <laughs> so I think I'll save that with my coin. And then this box goes blah, blah, blah. Bye bye. Okay, garbage. Gosh, I wish I had brought a box to donate stuff. I don't... <laughs> okay. Okay. Hey, ho. This is a box of stuff that has to go. Hey, hey. wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. I thought that was going to be a lot harder than it was. I will put these things over here in my picture taking area. Hi Rosie. Ooh, please don't fall. I'll take pictures later. This goes in here. Excellente. Hi Rosie. Okay. Feels good. I went through a sentimental box and I kept one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven things. That's all I kept. And there are things that I will put in little places or like in a drawer. Someplace, you know, they're not going to be displayed for reasons why I don't want to dust. But they can be used to put a little Aw, in a drawer or in a cabinet or something. So, I'm proud of myself. Okay, on to the next one. <laughs>